Excuse me, little dog. Excuse me, little dog. Jesus. Hi, guys. It is just another hot, sticky summer day. Here in the end times, in the great shithole state of Texas, where I am stuck for one more week. What the fuck was I thinking coming back to this shithole? But it is now Monday. May 2nd, 2022, and I'm waiting to hear the news whether the axle on my trailer is fucked up or not. And if it is, I am completely fucked. Uh, so wish me luck. Hopefully it's just the bearings. If, uh, if it's the axle on this trailer and they tell me I'm stuck in this shithole, for one more week. Good God Almighty. But anyway, since I am in the great state of Texas for another week, uh, of course the mainstream media offering some local Texas stories. And we have some very sad news. Some sad news coming out of the town of Freer, Texas. F-R-E-E-R. Freer, Texas, it kind of begs the question, freer than what? But anyway, we're all shedding a tear in the Lone Star State today as we find out rattlesnake handler dies doing what he loved after being bitten by a rattlesnake during Texas show. Yes. <laughs> a veteran, well, a former veteran rattlesnake handler died on Saturday, <coughs> hours after a rattlesnake bit him during a show, Texas officials said. Eugene DeLeon Sr. was bitten on the shoulder during the Rattlesnake Roundup event in Freer, police said. He was flown to Corpus Christi Hospital where he died. Mm. Organizers of the Kendall County Fair Association said DeLeon died, quote, doing what he loved, being with rattlesnakes. There you go. Doing what he loved, you know, otherwise known as torturing rattlesnakes. The rattlesnake roundup is put on by the Freer Chamber of Commerce, which mourned De Leon's death in a post on Facebook. Quote, The love and dedication he displayed torturing rattlesnakes for his community was witnessed every day from being a member of the Freer Volunteer Fire Department to being a call away for local residents to assist with removing snakes from their property. He was always ready to help. We will never forget his excitement during Rattlesnake Roundup time from doing interviews with TV stations to appearing on wildlife shows. He did it all. Yes. His sister said to Leon, quote, had a passion for snake handling and, well, up until Saturday, handled rattlers for many years. Yes. This is U.S. Congress candidate Sandra Whitten, quote, he was well loved by those who knew him, except by the rattlesnakes who knew him. My family and I enjoy watching him handle these deadly snakes with ease, almost like he was dancing with them. He had a smile on his face and clearly joy in his heart. Close quote. There you go. R.I.P. 
You, uh, you clueless moron, snake handler. Let's see. We have. <laughs> Let's see how many of the comments are in, in favor of the snake. Uh, I like this one. Wow. Who would have seen that coming? What a shock. Eight thumbs up. Yes. While I understand his love, his love for snakes, I would like to denounce the rattlesnake roundup as cruel and inhumane. It should be outlawed. Three thumbs up. Yes, here is process of natural selection. Here is no sympathy for fools. Twelve thumbs up. Here is way to go, Steve Irwin. Yes. As the saying goes, there are old pilots and there are daredevil pilots, but there are no old daredevil pilots. Yes. What became of the snake? Did the bite kill the snake too? This brilliant guy. And ha. Ha ha. <laughs> oh Lord, and for the record, I have eaten a Texas rattlesnake and it was delicious. It was very delicious. Uh, I remember we killed that thing and skinned it, made a uh, guitar strap out of the skin and cut it up and fried it like chicken fried steak and my friend Scooter we sit down to eat the, uh, we sat down to eat that rattlesnake and uh, Scooter looks around the table and says, you got any ketchup? Reminded me of that old Jeff Foxworthy. You might know you're a redneck. Uh, you might know you're a redneck when you're sitting in front of a single wide trailer in high Texas eating a dead rattlesnake and having your friend Scooter ask for the ketchup. <laughs> I went with honey mustard, by the way, because I am not a redneck. I, uh, I dipped my delicious rattlesnake uh, in honey mustard. That snake did not die in vain. I hear they have 100 pounds of uh, rattlesnake meat for sale uh, at the Freer Rattlesnake Roundup, but I guess the rattlesnakes are freer to roam uh, the hills of Freer. Now that the old rattlesnake molester is dead, but anyway guys, I have got to start packing up and I will find out in two hours how fucked I am about this trailer get out there and eat some rattlesnake while you still can. Bye guys.